Just get a good stretch in. Health is important to me, really important, physical and mental. I read some comments asking why I haven't been eating lately. <laughs> I'm like, I can eat, man. You want to see me eat? I'll eat. Ask and you shall receive. Here's me eating right now. I'll eat a freaking pizza in front of you. There's a comment right there, right in front of my face. Like, ow. Oh. Ate that comment. Yeah. But eating is not what I want to talk to you guys about. Like many of you, I'm kind of a weirdo. For example, I like to make scary faces at babies when their mothers aren't looking. This is one of my favorite activities. Well, you get the idea. And just generally, I think outside of the box, unless I'm literally in a box thinking, which I've been known to do. And finally, I tend to talk to myself, like a lot. I think it started when I was a child. I had two imaginary friends, Austin Apollo and Apollo Maluji. I think they were European, although I can't really be sure because they were pathological liars. And since I fancy myself as somewhat of an actor, don't tell anyone, I kind of tend to get obsessive about the delivery of some of my words. I'll repeat a line over and over and over until it sounds like flawless in my overly perfectionistic ear. Perfectionistic, overly perfectionistic. Over, overly perfectionistic ear, 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 ear. You know, so I'm constantly uh, just like, like just under my breath, like whispering to myself, either like a movie line, you know, I love movies. I recite movie lines for myself randomly. Or just a line for like one of these little videos that you guys watch and are probably getting tired of. And the possibilities are endless. My mind is always moving and tinkering around and I'm like, it's, it's just processing and then <laughs> farting out of my mouth. You know, my wife hears me and she's like, oh, talking to you what's wrong with you and i'm like no one nothing i'm nothing i'm fine well, i'm like castaway you know i'm like i'm like i'm like tom hanks but without the, the loincloth and the bloody volleyball and the the being casted away and a few times i've actually been caught by strangers or acquaintances muttering to myself like a homeless person and in college you know i used to walk to class and i'd be doing this i hey, you know what i mean yeah i know what you mean of course i know what i mean thanks for knowing what i mean man thanks you know what i mean i would know what you mean Know what I mean? Now, I didn't think that my mouth was ever really moving all that much until a girl in class told me- I've driven past you a couple of times on the way to class and just seen you talking away to no one. And so I'd be like, what's it to you, you cow? <laughs> I just got to but I actually ended up finding good ways to handle moments like that. You know, one was just really owning up to it. I actually, yeah, I, I tend to talk to myself sometimes, I guess. Uh, I've done it ever since I was a kid. I don't know, I write and so I do like, the scenes, I'm kind of like acting them out in my head. So it looks like I'm talking to myself. That's insane. Come on, we have a, we have a thing. There's the Invisible that... Friends guy, come on. Okay. Nor sometimes I took a different approach. Man, you can be an artist at any- You see? You see? You're totally doing it again. You're talking to yourself again. Oh. You're totally- Oh my God, Shelly. Oh. <laughs> She'll never walk again. Oh. And what I realized about the whole situation was that I'm just full of creative energy. And that's where you guys come in. Huh? Yeah, okay. Give yourselves a round of applause. A round of applause. It's round of applause, right? Round of applause. You guys ever do that? Yeah, it's stupid. You guys have totally been a creative outlet for me, and I just wanted to express my appreciation. I know I haven't been doing this all that long, but thank you for, uh, you know, providing me your attention so that I'm not just some uh, guy sitting in a room uh, talking to himself like a crazy person. Uh, all right, okay, it's okay. This is a very, I know what this looks like. You're very funny. It's a very funny joke that you can play as the viewer, jump around, be ubiquitous, like wherever you want to be, but it's, I, I don't really appreciate it. All right. Half cup soda, half soda. Kids, I encourage you. Adults, I encourage you to trick your kids into thinking that that's actually Coke. <laughs>